Okay guys, welcome back to my channel. I told you the other day that I was going to do a, uh, well I'll show you my sh new shoes that I bought and do a comparison with the old shoes and new shoes. So here we go. Here's the box. Well, that, I guess that was the bag from Amazon. And here are the shoes. The Sacone. Excursion TR. There it is. Excursion TR. Trail shoes, of course. Look at the bottom. Nice. Now, let's take a look at my shoes that I'm currently wearing with the damaged pinky toe area. Now, these ones, they are the Excursion TR13. Now, the new ones just say Excursion, and I'm not sure, I didn't, uh, I'm not sure if these are a new kind of uh, brand. Oh, and there it says it on the bottom. On the bottom it says Sacone. Now, according to Garmin, it says here that I've had 116 activities. You can, I don't know if you can see that or not. Underneath of the shoe, it says uh, Sacone Excur Excursion TR13, 116 activities since June 10th, 594 miles. And I went back and looked at my video. It was in June when I when I bought the uh, the ones that I'm wearing right now, and as you can see, the reason I bought these shoes was because my other ones, the the sole was popped, uh, pretty much wore out totally on the on the insoles were. Now this one here has the little pinky toe area. See, the little pinky toe area there. It was wore out on the last shoes and it also wore out on these ones now as far as the tread treads not too bad you still got a little bit a little bit of wear here and a little bit of wear here for sure but um, the new shoes being brand new they're not exactly the same type but um, I don't know if it's the first version, why they were a little bit cheaper. It cost me like about 50 bucks to be the uh, plus uh, shipping and handling. But uh, the see, you can see the, uh, they're not too different. The, 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 well, the bottoms are a little bit, but a little bit different. The, the soles, the, the uh, nubs are a little bit different on here. But, um, Main difference between these two, the old pair, this is a size 9. The new pair, this is a size 9 wide. So I'm hoping, I'm taking advice from uh, the Fit Rush. He, he said the reason, maybe the reason why I have, I'm having trouble with my pinky toe on this one is because I need a wider shoe. And this is a wide. I haven't tried them on yet. I'm going to try them on for the first time here. And I'm going to go on a run. Uh, maybe up to town and back about six miles and come back and and see see how they feel maybe but uh, I like the looks of them I like the collar I like the black I like the green I think my first pair of Sacconis had the uh, same kind of uh, collar uh, collar pattern green and black but I'm not sure it's been so long since I've since I've had them but I'm gonna go for a run come back and then I'll let you know how how I feel on the run or during or you know when I get back well so far so good uh, I feel like maybe they might be laced a little bit tight, but uh, feeling good on my feet. Uh, like I said, a little bit of tightness around the tops and my foot there, but uh, I just loosen them up for the next time. But I haven't slid any. I went through some unnecessary uh, 
mud back there I took the wrong you know I leaned the wrong way and had to go through some mud but that happens when you're on a trail that has mud but uh, I'm, I'm almost up to the senior center my turnaround spot uh, where I'll go I'll go a little bit further than that I think I'm gonna run home on the road on 250 so let's keep going Okay guys, I got uh, a little over seven miles in today at uh, one hour and about 11 minutes, I think. Something like that. Uh, shoes felt great. I did loosen them up a little bit. So uh, they weren't so tight around my foot there. So, so that helped a little bit. Uh, I guess the big deal is when I'm wearing these, and a few hundred miles will I still get that hole with the pinky toe area take a look there's my pinky toe there's my pinky toe it's bulging out still I guess we'll have to wait and see but uh, shred wise wear wise I think my other shoes are faring pretty good I might still go back and forth here and there maybe use those for short miles and use my new ones for longer miles but uh that's it for the today's video guys hope you enjoyed it uh let me know what you think about my new shoes how the old shoes are doing let me know what you run in how how many miles you let your shoes go before you replace them and how many shoes pairs of shoes do you have i'm getting a pair of road shoes next week so i'll have two pairs one for when i'm running up around town and one when i'm going to be running on the trail so we'll try it out see what happens but uh, like, comment, subscribe, guys. Um, don't forget, it's a great day to go for a run, wherever you may be. Get out there and get your run in. Get it done. And uh, you'll see me on the next one.